Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode, I am your host Spinozil and today we are going to be going through my Syria Nevada Park in Jurassic World Evolution 2. This video takes inspiration from Evolution Square's video where she put four different species, well four different feathered species inside of um, a really snowy park so the concept is only they can survive in this weather. Uh, it looks like we've started at a bad time because I think it's going to start raining. Uh, but, um, so yeah, just bear in mind, my, the design, like, effort goes really good at the start, but then it goes really terrible towards, like, the other parts of the park. So, uh, yeah, let's, um, let's get started. So first we have, uh, two spinal, uh, spinal skeleton. I do use them a lot in this park, so bear that in mind. Here we have this little centerpiece, which I'm quite proud of, personally. It's like, um, you've got all the dress Park lights. Uh, well, torch stand things. You have a uh, fountain in the middle here, which is pretty nice. So yeah, we're gonna continue going because I'm gonna try and speed through it a bit. We have two toilets because you, our guest needs comfort. We have these little planters here, which are just just to fill in a bit of space and stuff. Here we have two shops. We have the uh, drinks shop and the uh, sushi walk on a bit and we have two uh, gift shops walk up a bit more we have two shelters I'm aware of the design choice but I quite like it so I'm keeping it like that uh, we have a hotel here uh, which was added like today so I've been waiting on this for the last like two days uh, so the hotel was added literally before I started the video because uh, I didn't add any hotels and I didn't get to five stars because it because of my accommodation rating so I just put another hotel that so I just put a bunch of hotels down one in each section you'll get what i mean by sections in a minute uh here's our biosyn genetics um power station uh this is because we're using it as a um uh, uh, uh hyperloop system so yeah we're using it as a hyperloop system and that's how you get around so yeah here we we have two different well, two of the same fountains. Uh, here we have a viewing gallery, which we've used into the T-Rex enclosure. I assure you there is T-Rexes in here. There's six of them in here. But there's also a tour, so he's going that. Okay. Alright. Here's the tour. Alright. I picked these trees because they reminded me of like snowy stuff, so I just put them down. I'll try and follow the uh, tour as much as I can. Oh, here we are. Four T Rexes out of six. Yeah, you scram. There we are. There's four of them there. I think I'm supposed to go up this hill. Yes, I am. Alright, here we go. Here's another, another one there. I've already seen one of them. And there's literally one more that I haven't seen these down here, so. Alright. There he is. Or she. Whatever. And yeah, that's uh, the T-Rex tour, as I will call it. Alright, there we are. Uh, I do need to get out, however, so... So, you would come out here... And then you would uh, take the uh, hydro power hub, and this will take you two ways. You can either go this way or that way. I'm going to choose this way because this is what I did first. And here to the Avery. As you can see in there already, quite squatless in there. 
uh, and this is the uh, not as good design choice as it was. This is not as good as a design choice over here, but oh well, it'll have to do. Uh, oof, uh oh, ignore me messing up. I'm just trying to. I'm still getting used to keyboard, so. So here you have a gyrosta uh, gyrosphere station uh, where they will come along here. So yeah. Here we have five different Quetzalcoatluses. This guy. This guy. Him. Him. And should be one more. Oh, he's over there. Hold on a second. A feeder needs to be resupplied, but that's not the one. It is these ones over here. Sorry about this. Alright, never. Okay. Uh, so that was in there, so we're gonna go in first person, and we're gonna take a gyrosphere tool. It's nice and warm in here, I would imagine. Come on, let's take over this gyrosphere. Come on, open up for me. Alright, me. these trees are being used again. Not a very nice noise, is it? And there's all five, all sitting on their posts. We used a variety of skins. Most of them were random, apart from the uh, 2022 s style. I put that on on purpose because, because yeah, I just wanted to use the 2022. I always like to use at least one movie skin in my parks, and uh, there, there's your movie skin. So yeah. Alright, let's just go a bit. I, I really don't like that noise. Alright. Here we go, we're out of the Avery. Let's just tuck this back in. There we are. It's uh, in there. Right. So then you would take the, um, you go back and you take the uh, Hyperloop s s uh, station all the way up here. Oh, uh oh. Uh -oh. That needs to go. And then you would come out here. And again, you just introduce some shops. Some more shops, some more gift shops. Then going down a bit, uh, you have the two shelters, two toilets, and a viewing opportunity right there. And there should, there should be three. There's one down there, one down, one down there. Yeah, right there. One there, and there. There's a the hotel. And, uh, yeah, in here we have the Pyroraptors. This is the Pyroraptor Quarry. There are absolutely loads of Pyroraptors. And there is a movie skin one in here. And there's only one of them, actually. Yeah, there's like 18 Pyroraptors in here. There's the movie skin. It's right there. But yeah, there's loads of uh, power apps in here. So, let's take the tour. It should be... Ah, uh, I've gone the wrong way. Wait, where is the tour? Actually, yes, there. Not me forgetting where everything is. Alright, trust the tour. Alright, we're taking over this. Use 
because it's taking too long. Hold on. Just give me like two seconds. Uh, settings. Audio. Because it's really loud. Uh, where's the sound effect? So down to 45. Alright, there we are. There, it's turned down a bit. So, there is a really nice green one. Yellowish one. But yes, most of these are really nice coloured. That's the good thing about the Pyroraptor. Really nice feathers. Alright. Going up. Uh oh. Here is the quarry part of the part uh, of the build, but we'll go back down to that in a moment because we drive through the quarry. All right, we're gonna take over him, and we're gonna go down here because this is the way. Now and again you'll get some Pyroraptors running down the quarry to get to have food or water. We're going to take a little detour here to look at all the Pyroraptors. I really like this one. Your feathers are really cool. But there's like one like white one. There he is. And this one's really cool as well. Alright, but I'm going to get out of here. Alright, let's go. Oh, there's the movie skin one. Okay. Alright, and through the gates. And I'm going to leave this off the track because, yeah. And time for our final, final um, part of the park. Uh oh, I spawned. No, 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 no. I want Alright, here's the hotel. No, we're actually gonna go in this one. Can't see anything. But. It's fine. We don't really need to see anything over there anyway. Uh, yeah, ignore this. I'll explain it in a little bit. Uh, some more shops, obviously. This is where, like, my design is, like, really bad. Uh,. But sorry about that. So sorry about that little clip cut. Then uh, in here we have fr uh, five Ferrocinosauruses. There's one. There was another day. Uh, don't know where the others are. You know. Uh, there's two. And uh, I don't know where the other one is. Uh, but I'll have a look. Now on the uh, tool, because every single uh, enclosure has a tool. There we go. All right, so here we go. There's three, and then they're probably down there. Oh wait, there's four. I think no, it's three. They are huge. So there's like a green, a white, a pink, a purple, and the uh, uh, movie skin. They're really cool though, I really like the Ferrocinosaurus. I've, I've been begging for this to come out since the first game. And I'm so happy that they're finally in the game. There's the movie skin. And here's uh, one block in the road. Do you mind? Whatever. Alright, so, and this is a redwood bone, which I thought was pretty cool. So, uh oh. Ooh. Look how driver I am. I'm so drive. Okay. Alright, we did get a bit stuck there. So, uh, 
So yeah, um, I probably should explain this. Uh, so I wanted to have a little bit of story behind this park. I want to say that one T-Rex escaped ages ago and no one knows where it is, but it's really chilling in this forest. Um, so yeah, let me hop into capture mode. No, I'm not. I don't want to select dinosaurs. Right. Hang on a minute. Where is G? G is there. Okay. I'm still, as you can see, I'm still getting used to the keyboard. And here is our T Rex in the forest. And it has all it needs there, so. It's genuinely really comfortable here, so. So, yeah, it's really comfortable here. And this is where it will stay. So, this was the first part of the park. Um. So here you can see it all a bit better, there was like little lanes behind the uh, shops, so it, that was pretty cool. Uh, if, we, if we move down a little bit, then this was the uh, middle part which I found really cool. And this is the best path art I've done in a little while, so. So if you did enjoy, please leave a like, subscribe, I'll see you all in the next one, goodbye.